Watch okay, so here's my Sephora haul. Just like it literally made my day. It was the sweetest thing ever. Hey guys, what is up? So it's currently morning, or sorry, almost the afternoon. It's like 11.30 right now. Madison's in her nail appointment. She just had to come to get her nails fixed because she got, she got them done like a few days ago and her acrylics are like the paint is chipping off. So she came to get them fixed. And I just came along. She wants to go pick up a few things after and I want to get a few things. We might even go thrifting, doing some errands. It's literally pouring rain. I went for a fitting this morning. I woke up at like 6.30 and I am just so so tired i haven't eaten yet i haven't had a coffee i haven't had anything yet yeah so i had my fitting and then when i got home i took a nap like a 20 minute nap and then went out with madison right away and now we're here so there's literally one chipotle or there was one chipotle near me and the chipotle that was near me was literally like 40 minutes away from my house and they just opened a new chipotle that's like 20 minutes away from my house and we're right near it so we might go eat there right now like after she's done her nails because we both haven't eaten anything today i literally have to boldly like maybe once a year just because it's not near me yeah i know it's like really i feel like more popular in the states like they have them everywhere but here in canada don't really have much anyways i'll give you guys an ootd because my outfit is really folly today so i got this crew neck on from our deans like this is really old and then i have my flary yoga pant things from princess polly and i just kind of tucked my crew neck into my sports bra so you can see the little cute design here and then i have my princess polly tote bag can i get a grande iced uh, pumpkin spice latte sure. with um vanilla sweet cream cold foam yes. and can i get that light ice please A grande iced pumpkin spiced latte with oat milk. With oat milk. Can you give me just like a water? Uh, no, uh, light ice as well, please. No, thank you. And then can I just get a, a cup of water, please? I couldn't think of the word for some reason. Water, and then we're gonna remake the one with oat milk. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Thanks. Cheers. Mm. I'm gonna be so sad when they get rid of it, but then so happy when they get their Christmas drinks. What do they have at Christmas? Gingerbread latte. It's so good. Watch too. the camera before it falls. And they're like, ah! Finish up at the mall, and now we're at a thrift store, Red Valley Village. Who wants to see what I bought? I got some skincare things, not skincare, sorry. Yeah, some skincare things and some sunscreen. I'll show you guys when I get home from Sephora. So I have a little haul for you guys. Look what I bought. I didn't mean to, but I went in the store and I couldn't resist. She didn't even think about it. She literally just bought them. Anyways, y'all know, maybe y'all know I like shoes, so I just bought these new Jordans. Retro highs. You don't like mids out here. I like the color. You know, mustard. Love that. So anyways, now we're going to go thrifting because I've just been wanting to go for a while and I'm not going to buy anything like dumb. Like I'm not going to just like... That's a lie. No, no, no. Like this time, like I'm serious. Like I just want to find like good like pieces for the season. I'm looking for one thing and one thing only and I'm swearing to myself to not spend money on anything else because I just bought those shoes and I did it me too. I just want to find a really nice black puffer vest. I want to get like actually like I want to find like a jacket like a puffer hopefully which is probably highly unlikely or like look for hoodies and crew necks because I'm just like obsessed like it's all I wear so let's hope we find something because we're at like a different valley village that we never go to like this one's far away from our house so let's hope that there's some spicy things <laughs> guys so it's a bit later and i was just like chilling um i got some stuff i'm gonna give you guys a haul but i literally i'm kind of like not stressed out but like you know when you don't mentally prepare yourself for something and then you're like oh shit so i had no idea that i 
was gonna be on set tomorrow like my agency just told me that it was gonna be like a covid test so that's what i was prepared for mentally and then stuff got mixed up and now i'm gonna be on set tomorrow it's not like stressful really necessarily but thankfully i'm like i have a flexible like job and stuff but like my plan for tomorrow was like to edit and stuff and just like do work so now that kind of pushes me behind because i had no idea that i was going to be on set tomorrow i guess that's what i signed up for though because this industry is crazy but so yeah i'm just like not mentally prepared for that now i just i have to get a video up for tomorrow that's not up yet i'm pretty much done editing it i just have to add in a couple of things and then upload it make the thumbnail still like ugh, i still gotta do kind of a lot of shit for that video that i was planning on doing tomorrow morning but now i kind of have to cram um but anyways i'm here because i just wanted to show you guys what i got okay so if you guys watched like one of my last vlogs i'm not sure when i was talking about this i think it was my last vlog actually where i was thinking that i want to get a new laundry bin i looked at walmart and there was no laundry bin i found a laundry bin you guys and i got it at winners i also got some shit thrifting so there's i actually bought a lot of shit today this is my laundry bin it's actually like i'm like really happy with it it's just exactly kind of what i was looking for i just wanted exactly something this size and yeah because this is my old laundry bin right here that's it and it's just like pretty big and the reason why that i don't like it big like that is because like i know this is all my fault and like it has really nothing to do with the laundry bin but mentally it does and i just i'm just making excuses but in my brain since it's big i just let the laundry fill up in it and then i do laundry literally once a month and my mom's like you can't be doing your laundry once a month like you need to do it in smaller loads and like space it out more so i'm like okay and like i broke the top off of that like it's cracked and it just like i don't know i've had it for a long time and i just want to spice things up something smaller you know because that kind of takes up a lot of room in my closet so um yeah this is a cutie little basket like i don't know it's just really cute and i feel like this is a really good quality and this is something like when i move out like i'll take out with me and i feel like it'll last me a long time and i'll show you what i got thrifting right now um i also have a little sephora haul that i'll show you like later but thrifting i didn't get too much i got three things so first thing that i got are these sweatpants and they're just like black and they say timber wolves kp i don't know i just like this like it's cute it's a cute patch they're just black and they look like they're gonna like fit perfectly and i honestly don't really have any black sweatpants that fit me right and that just like i really like so and then i got navy sweatpants and these ones are really cute i'm not gonna try them on because i haven't washed them yet um, they say Wist Life. They're made in Canada. Oh my god, I didn't even notice that. Yeah, they feel really good quality and you guys know I'm a sucker for sweatpants and stuff. And then the last thing that I got is a, just this little kind of cropped sweater because I have a, like one or two gray sweaters, but I feel like I'm just wearing them all the time. So it's good to have, like this is a little bit of a different style. In my world, you can never have enough. So that's what I got thrifting. And this is really random, but I picked up this tumbler cup because Madison wanted to go to Michael's to get a couple of baking things. And I saw this and it was only $5 and I've been looking for like a tall um, clear cup like this. And they were on Amazon for like 20 bucks each or 25 And I was like, I don't want to spend that much just on a clear tumbler cup. And I found this one at Michael's for literally $5. It was the last one left. But yeah, this is just good for like water, coffee, anything really. It's just basic, but I love it because it's just simple cute and yeah let's switch over my laundry bin so we can see how it looks and i also got to finish editing that video tonight so i was also supposed to like i had something planned for tomorrow i was gonna someone messaged me on instagram and they wanted you to do like a photo shoot and stuff so i had that planned for tomorrow i was gonna do that tomorrow and i had to cancel which is sad like i hate i literally hate canceling on people it's like one of the things that i feel so bad about obviously like that's out of my control but i still feel so guilty like i'm a very guilty person i just feel bad for anything like someone can literally trip me and then i'd be like oh my god like i'm sorry like, it's my fault like i'm so bad for that like i just have to learn that like it's okay like you don't gotta feel guilty for everything because like that's just how i am i'm so like empathetic i can't help it like i just feel guilty over anything and everything oh my god but that looks so cute in the closet okay don't mind my room already being a mess after i just cleaned it <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, so here's how she looks. Um, I like how it doesn't take um, like as much room up in my closet. I like how it's just kind of in the corner, like it's very mobile, it's cute. And I feel like this is like perfectly one load of laundry so that it's gonna force me to like do laundry more often. But let me know what you guys think, if you like it or not. Okay, so here's my Sephora haul. I got this Laniege Goodnight Kit. This was only $13, and I was originally just gonna buy the lip balm alone, which was like almost 30. So it came with this, and then it came with a water sleeping mask to hydrate your skin. So I'm like, you know what? Why not try it out since the lip balm is in here anyways? Apparently this lip balm is literally the best. They also had it in vanilla, but I'm just gonna try and see how I like it. And if I do, then I'll buy the full size. And I've been wanting to get this for so long. This is a super goop. Um, unseen sunscreen 40 SPF and I've been just wanting a sunscreen to put on under makeup or when I don't wear makeup Because I don't like to wear anything tinted when I'm not wearing makeup just because when I don't wear makeup I don't want to wear any sort of makeup and I honestly don't even wear makeup anymore Like I probably put on makeup once a week now so this is perfect for just an everyday morning sunscreen. It was pretty pricey, but I really just wanted to try it out and see how I like it because apparently it doesn't feel like anything on your skin. It's super lightweight, so I'm really excited for this. And then I got the Ordinary Hyaluronic Acid in a big formula because I have it in a little, but it's running out, so I wanted it in a big one. And I don't know, Hyaluronic Acid is just supposed to be like really good for your skin. And then I got Rosehip Seed Oil. Coming into these drier months, I do like mixing rose hip seed oil in to my moisturizer i'm pretty sure it has a, a lot of other benefits if you just want to search it up but the ordinary is also really cheap like literally this was like maybe like eight dollars and then this the big size was like 10 or 12 i don't know but it's so cheap hey you guys so i'm just about to head out um i'm just picking up some breakfast but i just wanted to show you what i'm wearing so these are my sweatpants that i thrifted and then this is the crew neck that i i mean zip up little sweater that i thrifted and I just wanted to quickly show you guys it on because I didn't like show it on. But these sweatpants are so cute and such good quality. And this sweater is just so nice just to throw on like literally with anything. I'm very happy. So I'm about to go pick up some breakfast because we were just like craving breakfast. And it's also like Halloween weekend. So I'm like, you know what? Why not? I'm going to bring some home for everyone. So we're going to have cute breakfast in. It is such a beautiful day. Mm. Skies are literally blue and then the trees are orange. So it makes it look so pretty. I just wanted to quickly say, I was in the drive-in yesterday at Tim Hortons to pick up a wrap and a coffee before I was going to drive set, through. drive through. And I get to the window and they're like, oh, the lady in front of you paid for your order. And I'm like, like that was the sweetest thing ever. Um, I literally didn't expect that. I don't think that's ever happened to me before. And that Did was, you carry it on? I was going to, I was like, is there anyone behind me? And there wasn't, so I couldn't carry it on. Anyways, it was just like, it literally made my day. It was the sweetest thing ever. Okay, we're gonna go pick up food. It's such a beautiful day! Oh, I also still need to book tickets for the pumpkin patch. myself a nice coffee and me and Joel are about to go on a walk with Zeus because it's a beautiful day today and I've basically just been inside so we're gonna go take him out on a walk I'm literally obsessed with my new cup that I got from Michaels the one that was literally six dollars I'm obsessed with it it's like so perfect
just finished at the pumpkin patch. We're just we're walking in the, the car. We're in the red zone, dude. This is it. <laughs> Are you in the score app? Yeah. So we're not even leaving here with pumpkins. We literally just came to pet the animals. We didn't even walk through the pumpkin patch because it's the 31st, so it's literally on Halloween. So 